this is a quick look of our IP PTZ EL 2MP L12X Mini I and I'm going to be showing you what it comes inside the box and some of the accessories that you can find in the box. Um, it will come with a CD. In the CD you will have instructional uh, videos, instructional manuals. Also it will come with this uh, installation manual and here you can refer to the uh, dip switches uh, everything that you need to do of, uh, in reference to how to mount the camera and some of the features of the camera. It will come with a pattern for you to mount the camera. Uh, this uh, Allen key for you to open the camera and also comes with screws and some gaskets uh, to use at the time of installation. It will come uh, with gloves and uh, this particular camera uses a 24 volt 1.5 amp uh, power supply or if you have a PoE Plus, which our PoE One, uh, it's capable of uh, being using with this camera. PoE Plus provides more power, so uh, you can use it with this particular camera. Um, this is the camera itself. You can see it has some wrapping right now. I didn't remove it. I don't want to scratch the dome, but it's a very simple camera. It's a dome style. It's a speed dome style. And you can see here, it will have the four holes for you to uh, put the uh, screws through it. And it will come with a pigtail. And in the pigtail, you will find um, the Ethernet jack. Here you can put uh, your Ethernet cord, or if you have a PoE, you can put it in there. And connect your PoE with a cable here, and then the camera will power it up without the necessity of using the 24-volt power supply included. Uh, you will have uh, positive and negative and ground and everything is properly labeled. Also this camera supports alarm and you will have uh, all of uh, the you know wire colors and color code in, in regards of that and also you can connect a microphone. So uh, I'm gonna give you a quick look of the inside so you will have to do this uh, before you install it. So do not turn it on when you install a camera Okay, when you're mounting the camera, do not turn it on because the camera comes with a, a foam to reinforce the uh, uh, structure inside the, the camera so the lens doesn't move at the time of uh, shipping. Very easy, it's just three screws and then this comes out. Notice here it has like a little um, mark as well in the base. In the base you will have another mark. This, when you're putting this back on the camera, make sure that this mark matches that on the base as well. Uh, this is a dome. You can see the screws are there. And this is the foam that keeps this in place. So when you have the base on or you have the cover of the camera on, the ca this doesn't move. Um, here's the camera itself. This camera supports uh, SD, micro SD card, so you can insert right there. Class 4 up to 32 gigabytes. So you can record footage to itself. Uh, you will have the, the blower, the heater and blower there. And these are the general stuff, you know, the general components of the camera, but it's very easy to install. It's very easy to use. You'll need to take that uh, dome off for you to install it, and there you can see the uh, installation holes over there and it's very easy to to install it's a very cool camera it provides you a crisp picture it's awesome uh, make sure that I have this correctly and also it has a gasket on it just so you know just to make sure it's white so it's very easy to to miss but it is there make sure that it's there at the time of uh, the installation so water doesn't get in in the camera okay I'm just going to set it in there in the meantime. Uh, this camera has a 3 inch 2 megapixel Sony Exmor CMOS. So it provides you a great quality picture. The lens is uh, 5.1 millimeter to 61.2 millimeter. So you can zoom in very far and then you can zoom out and get a great detail, you know, get a, a, a great white image. Uh, while you're doing that. It supports up to 2 megapixels, so it's 1080p. It can go also to 720p or D1. It is uh, on VIF, so if you have 
uh, product that supports UMVIF compatibility or UMVIF protocol, you can use this camera with. And uh, once again, it supports PoE1 or PoE Plus, I'm sorry. Uh, you can power this up with a PoE Plus device. We recommend to use our PoE1 um, uh, PoE system that we have. And, or if you're not uh, wanted to use that, you can use a 24 volt included with it. And uh, the camera is an excellent camera for indoors. Um, it's available on our website right now, and I hope you like it.